Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here. And we are back in Ark. There's our little friend right here, our little dung beetle. And it worked, guys. We are making fertilizer, we are making oil. That's what we got out of one large poop. Which is awesome. So we're going to go ahead and up his weight. And we're going to go get some more poop. <clears throat> now, you might be wondering, why do I got all my dinosaurs out here? What is going on? Well, guys, I finally got around to rebuilding the pen. Well, I'm starting to. I haven't fully got in there yet. I didn't want to finish. I wanted to bring you all in on a little bit of the building. Which, we'll check this out. But first, let me grab a large poop here. Um... Can you poop for me? No, you're not ready yet, huh? Oh. We got a poop right here. Might be a small one, but it's still a poop. I'm not exactly sure how much he can he can hold, or she, or it, or... Yep, no gender. Okay, so it's an it. Now, I wanted to show y'all something cool, guys. They just added this in the update just literally like a couple hours ago. See how it says pick up? We are holding our dung beetle. What do you think about that, guys? Kind of holding him a little weird, though. We kind of got a hand a little far inside him, but we are holding the dung beetle. Now, you kind of got to be careful when you're holding him because when you go to release him, he throws them a little bit. But we can now pick up and hold the dung beetles so we can pick up and hold the dodos. Which I will show you all that in just a second. What is that? Hold on. Uh, where's my spyglass? There it is. That red thing out there has caught my eye. What is that? Now, oh, just some seaweed. Okay. Never mind, never mind. Go ahead and put that up. But anyway, let's check out our little platform pin dilly that we got going. So, basically, right now it is the exact, well, yeah, it is the exact same size that our pin used to be. Now, I know it looks a little bit small. Hold on, I gotta pick up a dodo. We gotta check this out. We are holding a dodo, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that. Hold on. Oh, now that's just wrong. Okay, we can squat with it. We can't do nothing else, but we can sure squat with it. Alright, hold on here. Can I turn you back and put you back with the others? There you go. Anyway, <clears throat> we've come up here. Our pen was one tile further over. So, <clears throat> we can go one tile further back and we'll be at the exact same size as before. Now, we're going to go bigger because we have more dinosaurs. We're running out of room. I'd like to be able to bring the mammoths and T-Rexes and all that up here as well. I don't want to have to leave them out. We did have a little bit of a problem with this little gap right here. I don't know exactly what was going on, but in order for me to do it like this, I had to I had to gap it for some reason. I don't I think it had to do with the placement of this first pillar because as you can see, instead of being having a little nub sticking up, it's right on top of it. So, I might have messed up in placing this one, because this is where I started, but I couldn't really think of much else to do. What I had done is I would put a, found, or a ceiling out, I had put a pillar on it, and then I had built up, or actually, I built down, then I built up, and then I went across. Now, just so y'all know, we have us another generator. I put it under here. We got... A light down here. I'm going to get rid of that. Well, I don't have to get rid of it, but that food trough will become inactive, so don't worry. Got another light on this side. 
unfortunately there's a couple of gaps we couldn't really do anything with that I might be able to put <clears throat> a little railing in there and it might cover it up a little bit but other than that there's not much I can do at this point alright guys what do we got what do we got um ah yes we had some names for the dinosaurs I've been busy I haven't had a chance to get to them I do apologize we are getting to them right now all right our frog the best suggestion was Kermit if I remember how to spell Kermit Let's see I got my got my caps lock on here hang on Kermit there we go so our frog is now named Kermit uh, what else do we got what else do we got ah the ankles let's see here's the mail okay now I wasn't sure I'm pretty sure that go ahead up your damage oh hang on here what was I saying guys the anklo is gonna be called Bob Ross alright we got Bob Ross the anklo still got another anklo I'm not a hundred percent sure if they were meaning Bob and Ross or if it was just Bob Ross so we're just gonna go with Bob Ross on this one and our scorpion, our new scorpion, the name Scor Scorpius was name was the name for this one. So now that we got that one, <coughs> um, what else do we got, guys? I don't know. I think that's all of the ones that we have so far. <coughs> Minus a few. We still haven't got any names for the Dodicaruses yet. Uh, Dodos, the little dogs, Dillos. Still got plenty of things. We got our spider. We haven't, well, before at, at the time of this recording y'all do not know I have the spider so I'm trying to get a little bit ahead here guys okay we are gonna hop down here I got some stuff pre-made let's see let's take a couple of these And let's go ahead and start laying these out. Okay, now we are the exact size of our old pit. Oh, I need to go out one more, don't I? Minus the little one wide space on each side, which I might go ahead and carry that over. I don't know just yet. I might put a wall and I don't know. We'll see, guys. We'll see. Let's see. Foundation. Of course not, because I don't have a foundation. I uh, gotta go get some more. Take these. Got a ton of those. And we're encumbered. Hang on. Alright, let's get back up here. Okay, it's going to do this maneuver on me. That's okay. And. One more. 
Okay. Well, let me hop down here. And we'll place us a couple foundations. There we go. And there we go. And come on. Well, now you're going to be stubborn, aren't you? Oh, there we go. <clears throat> Guys, sometimes when you put those pillars down, you have to go all the way around them just to make sure they go. Oh, did I just have it a second ago? There it is, right there. All right. Let's get back up here. And we got that much. All right, let's go ahead and bring it out one more. <clears throat> and that is all of those. So how many more do we need? We need one, two, three, four, five. All right, let's see. We have... Throw some of that off. Let's see one more. And let's make five ceilings. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to take the Dodicruses out and get more stone, but that is what they're there for, so. Alright, let's throw this back in here. And one last one. There we go. Now, let me see here. Um, trying to think here, guys. Hang on a sec. Is this going to be big enough? Or do we need to go bigger? Well, I don't know. Let me see here, guys. Hold on. Let me bring up a couple of dinos. <clears throat> Let's just get a size comparison up here, all right? Now, I do plan on putting a wall... And <clears throat> I might do a ceiling. I'm not sure yet. Hang on one sec, guys. I'll be right back. All right, guys. Sorry about that. I had to give me a drink. My uh, throat was messing up on me there. So let's go ahead and grab old Carlos. Well, he moves a lot quicker than I thought he used to. Let's see. We'll throw another one on your stamina. Two on your stamina. Awesome. Such a good dino. Alright, what else do we got? Um, let's go ahead and take the ankles up. Try to keep some of the mate boosted things together. <clears throat> Which I do plan on getting another Carno. Don't worry, guys. I do plan on getting Carlos a, a friend, if you will. 
Um, we could probably hop you up here. Now we'll probably move them around, but for right now, this is just kind of a a rough here they are type thing. We can even bring up our old mammoth. Granted, he takes up almost all the room himself, but he is here. Mm. I could bring these two up if I wanted. I'm gonna add a little bit to your bite. What about you? What you got, girl? Alright. Got a little bit more health. Um, I could bring them up. I mean, I am building the wall over there, but it's not quite far enough long yet. <clears throat> and I could always put the anklos down here or something. I'm not 100% sure just yet, guys. I do know we are going to put walls on this because right now something could come up and everything just run off and yeah it'll be a mess so I can either put walls on this or I could keep working on our big wall over there to kind of block stuff which would kind of work uh, we still have the Argentavis problem but we do have the species X plants that will help with that we might have to put a few more further back and around the sides a little bit, but I think that might work. So, yeah, I think that'll work, guys. What kind of building materials do we have left? We have some walls. Let's bring the walls and go around to the side. And we'll just throw a few of these up here. I really wish they... <clears throat> you could fit them into the ground, guys. I really wish they'd do that. A little bit of non-collision wouldn't hurt. I mean... That's my thought on it. A little bit would not hurt. Um, yeah, see, that's where we messed up right there. Not perfect, not perfect, but... We're just off by a little bit, but it's alright. Building an arc can be very difficult at times getting everything just straight up perfect on the first go around yeah that's pretty unheard of ah I made it uh -huh. all right guys well I hope everybody has been enjoying the series if you have be sure to like the videos and do me a favor guys and hit that subscribe button for me show all y'all support and it is as always greatly appreciated I can't stress enough how much I appreciate each and every one of y'all. So, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving.